Okay, today I will be showing you how to hook up your uh, Nintendo DS Lite or uh, Reginald to Wi-Fi. Okay, so first we have a game card inserted. I'm going to be using Call of Duty World at War. Okay, so this. Okay, turn it on. Dang it. So first, we're going to get it set up and everything. Okay, so on this one, you just if it'll say when you buy it, it'll have like Wi-Fi in the corner somewhere. And when you start up the game, you there, there'll be like single player and multiplayer, and then you go to Wi-Fi connection or Wi-Fi setup or anything like that. There's Wi-Fi. Then it has multiplayer online stats on this, and then it has Nintendo Wi-Fi setup. You go and check it. Yes. Okay, so you'll see. Oh, wait for the camera to see it. Come on. It's the lighting. Too much light. Okay. But you'll see like a over here you will see a little um options button then right in this area you'll see a um Nintendo Wi Fi connection setting. Okay, back Nintendo Wi-Fi connection set up. You want to go to connection. Nintendo Wi-Fi connection settings. Go there. Now I've already got two ready, but I'm gonna go to this one. Um, and it's gonna say search for an access point, A O S S, or manual setup. You want to go to search for an access point if you have a Wi-Fi connection. Searching. Found one. See? Okay, it'll show up on this little list right here. You click on the one you want. See, see that? You click on the one you want, and you type in your WEP code. I'm going to show that to you. If you can't see it. Then, after you type it in, you're going to hit OK. Then it's going to ask you, do you want to save these settings? Hit yes if you do, or it'll say OK or no. Hit OK. Connection settings have been saved. Tap OK to start a connection test. OK. And it's going to run a connection test to see if it can connect to that wireless network. It's showing it can. Okay, connection successful. That's uh, all I have to do. Now, if you go to options, system information, erase Nintendo Wi Fi connection, transfer Nintendo Wi Fi connection, transfer Nintendo Wi Fi configuration on the system will be erased once it has transferred to the destination Nintendo S. Do you want to proceed? Um, right now, I'm not going to do it, but um, in my next video, I will show you what that is. So no, man. System info. The MAC address is for this is um zero zero if thirty two zero nine five three ed. Um, yeah. I don't know what a MAC address is. And then it says Nintendo Wi-Fi connection ID. And yada yada. Then if you go to erase Nintendo Wi-Fi connection, it says, are you sure you want to erase your Nintendo WFC ID and connection settings? You probably don't want to do that. 
unless you're okay you can go back if you go to Nintendo Wi-Fi connection settings and go to connect to your USB Wi-Fi USB connector that's if you have like a landline instead of a wireless network like a landline you plug this little USB adapter you can get like a Walmart or GameStop or something and you plug it into your USB plug on your computer and it should just um, hook up a wireless connection through your DS and so far I've got two one two three connections and then if you go to this install your Nintendo Wi-Fi USB connector software and then insert like it will come with a disk insert the Nintendo Wi-Fi USB connector into your computer's USB tap OK to continue I don't have one so I can't do it okay you just go back back then it'll start your game over again and that's basically how you do it watch my next video to see how to transfer it okay that'll be it